With our callout bar created, the next thing we'll do is insert the table that contains our main image. We'll create this table under our callout table. Inside this table, create a table row. And inside the table row, create a table column. Give this column an alignment attribute set to center because we want the image to be in the center of the column. And inside this column, create a nested table. Then create a table row. And insert the column that contains the image. Now this image can be found in your downloads folder. So you can use this image or you can use another image of your choosing. So you can see we've given this column a center alignment attribute. We've inserted the image with a source attribute set to the image name. And remember to keep this image in the same folder that your HTML page is stored in and then set the width and height of the image as well. Now press refresh. And you can see that the image is inserted.